This is the True Real Estate 911 podcast with Lisa True. Lisa will share up to date real estate information with you that you need to know. Welcome to True Real Estate 911. It is Brian Mudd along with your local real estate pro, Lisa True. And not only do you get the best local real estate information right here, you get other helpful information that has to do with the real estate process. I'll never forget working with the True Group when we purchased our home and some of the great advice, including something that I wouldn't have considered without them, which was a home warranty. And that's one of the things we're gonna be talking about on today's show and where it can really make a lot of sense and help you save potentially a lot of money. It's not just about insurance, it's about a strategy going into purchasing a home as well. And the Trues are there to help you every step of the way. And as we get going, if you're not already there, go to truerealestate911.com. And when you get to truerealestate911.com, well, you will find a, a resource that is uh, just comprehensive as can be. Uh, from the ability to search the MLS like a real estate pro, the videos that the Trues put out there with all the latest information, some of the tips and tricks with local real estate, and of course, all the contact information for the Trues as well, which are ready to help you seven days a week buying, selling. If you just have questions, 561-972-8326. That's 561 561- 972-8326. All right, Lisa. So uh, as we are taking a look at, uh, you know, moving straight into summer, and it's crazy that we're in June, but as we head towards uh, summer officially, we've seen some indications that the local real estate market is cool. What are you seeing in the field? Well, I think that I hear that, and yet we're super busy. Now, I do feel a little bit of a difference between last summer selling season and this summer selling season, which remember remember here in uh, South Florida starts in March or April, we are seeing it be a little bit slower than last year. And yet our team is super busy. So when you price your property right, when you do all the right things, you still are able to get the success even in what would be considered a cooler market. Well, and that's just it. You know, even in a market that has changed and that might be a little bit cooler, it doesn't mean that homes aren't selling, just uh, the ones that aren't positioned right. And Trues uh, definitely can can help you with that. Now, as we are are talking about home warranties, uh, I, I mentioned uh, my anecdote working with, with you and Steve and going through and, and getting the recommendation to go with the home warranty. And really, it was just my trust in you that made me go along with it. My instinct was was the other way. And it turned out to save us thousands of dollars. It was the right call. Tell us about that end of of the advisement process that you provide for folks you work with. A home warranty for me really brings me back to when I bought my first home. We did not have a great experience. I mean, those of you who know my story of why I got into real estate, it was part of of this issue, um, is that getting the wrong advice. And so in the first year that we owned our first home as a first time home buyer that honestly didn't have a lot of extra money. Everything needed to be replaced within our our home from our AC to our appliances and everything worked on day of closing, but over time it just didn't. And so I have always been a fan of having a home warranty at least the first year as you get to know your home. And it's one of those things that's very inexpensive insurance However, one thing that people don't realize is that a seller can provide a home warranty as a marketing incentive. And we've had great success with setting our properties maybe apart from everything else when they have that peace of mind, that buyer who's looking at the home, it becomes the tipping point often between two properties. And, you know, when you're you're thinking about considerations like that, most of us, when we're buying a home, we're not thinking at that level. We're going, oh, we can see this for ourselves and our family or this. That That's where you strategically can really help us with some of those contextual things that I think otherwise would be missed. Yes, it's really understanding the person's situation and the home as well. Um, I would recommend a home warranty for everybody, like I said, the first year. That way you kind of know. Uh, what you're getting into. But if you have a home that is older and you're on a tight budget, it's a really good investment. And often we can even get sellers to pay for that uh, you know, upfront cost. So you have p- additional peace of mind that if something breaks, you're not going to wonder, how am I going to afford to replace this you know, big stainless steel refrigerator as an example? Okay. And so on today's show, we're going to be speaking with your partner. For home warranties, K 
Kim Hibbs from HWA Warranty. Tell us about Kim and, and why you recommend working with her. Well, we love the partnership that we have. We we have a great partnership where if we have a, a question or a concern, we can pick up the phone. We're not just calling an 800 number. And I love that. I love that I can get a real answer from somebody who knows me and cares about my clients at a different level. And so that's why we trust them. And we look forward to recommending them to our clients. And we are joined now by Kim. Kim, uh, welcome to the show. Thank you for taking the time with us today. And tell us a little bit about the experience working with Lisa, working with the True Group and her clients on home warranties. Well, thank you so much for having me today. Um, It is just, it's a great pleasure to be able to work with Lisa and her team. Um, We always are looking to, you know, build those partnerships and relationships with um, our realtors and um, build those lifetime relationships with each other and um, offering, you know, assistance on the home warranty side um, wherever possible. You know, Kim, uh, Lisa mentioned some of the circumstances where they really can make a lot of sense, especially older homes and the like. Uh, From your vantage point, what are some of the misconceptions or just unknowns people often will have when it comes to a home warranty? Um, Basically, you know, they, a lot of times uh, walking into a property, um, they may have some things that are working on the inspection report at that time, and then several months down the road, um, they will have a failure with either an air conditioning unit or an appliance, um, and that's where the home warranty will kick in and cover those um, those items and help limit those out-of-pocket expenses on the unexpected breakdowns to the homeowners. And Lisa... When you're working through these details, one of the advantages of uh, working with the True Group, how you have specialists in every aspect of the real estate process. Steve, for example, his background in building and construction, he understands so many of these different details that you know an average real estate agent wouldn't have that kind of perspective. How does that factor into some of these thoughts and, and considerations? Well, we look at the inspection report, of course, and look at the age of the appliances. I mean, if everything is brand new and, and uh, you know, the misconception, I think, with the warranties, people think it's just your appliances, and that is not true. It covers so many other components of your property. And so we look at the age of that home and how it's been cared for. And even though everything may be working today, maybe a tenant was in there and it over time, things just aren't gonna last as long. So we're gonna look and really, just as we do everything, it's very customized to what we can expect from that home and you know none of us have a crystal ball however for five or six hundred dollars if you could just say look if one thing dies in the year you are ahead of the game and statistically things do break when you own a home and it's also wonderful if you have an investment property because you have, again, peace of mind that if something breaks, that you've got a great service that you can call if you're maybe not local or out of state, because they have vetted the companies that they're using. So you don't have to wonder, well, what plumber am I gonna call? Or what electrician am I going to call? You have one person to call, one number to call, and they'll take care of that coordination. Kim, let's talk about that. There's some people that are concerned that the warranty will actually pay off, that it will follow through. Lisa's talking about having the companies that are already there that are dependable to work with. Uh, speak to the, the credibility of your product. So all of our vendors are licensed and bonded um, professionals. Um, that we contract with with our company. So um, there is, you know, no hesitation as far as we're just going to send out someone um, that that doesn't know um, their trade very well. So that is all um, taken care of on our end by our contract relations team. Um, we also will always use new parts on anything that has to be repaired or replaced. Um, so as far as that, and we also, you know, look to always build that relationship, even with the contract side, um, and, and get the best possible that we can to work with our company to ensure that the customers are being serviced in a timely fashion as well. Lisa, in, in terms of the experience, I know that if you recommend something and it doesn't go well, you'll hear about it. I know that's certainly the case. 
It's one of the exciting things having worked with you over the years. I still to this day that have one person come back and say that uh, it, it was not a good recommendation, you know, over 10 years later. And so in, in your case, you put your credibility on the line speaking about this. I mean, that speaks volumes. Yeah. You know, one of the things that that there's a lot of warranty options out there um, there's a lot of companies that do it even locally. Right. That that will warranty something. And yet. Kim mentioned something that I think a lot of people don't realize, and she said repair or replace. That is a big key when you're looking for a warranty company is what is their policy on, will they just fix it till at forever? Or at some point, we know that there's something called end of life. An appliance or an electrical issue, or maybe something actually needs to be replaced, like your, the air conditioning unit. There comes a point where they just can't fix it anymore. And so understanding the home warranties policy on replacement is key. And it's one of the reasons why I endorse them is because they do have a a solid replacement policy. Now, that does not mean that, okay, I don't like my refrigerator. I want a brand new one. I'm going to call them up. They're going to bring a different type of refrigerate or out right but it also is confidence that if they will replace it with a like product which is awesome we also look at the other extras and which one makes sense because i'm not just about spending people's money but there are some things that maybe you need like add-ons to your warranty to make sure you have the proper coverage for you so we go through that prior to closing it's really important if you're buying to go ahead and and get that policy taken care of ahead of time put it on the closing statement so you have coverage right away sure and what most people don't understand is that there are seller there's seller coverage now it's there's some limitations to it but there's seller coverage as well as if the seller wants to provide it to the buyer and then the buyer coverage does not start till closing so there's 13 months of coverage for that buyer, which again is a huge, huge selling point. Kim, in terms of the uh, turnaround, you know, if we buy a home warranty, how long does it take before it goes into effect? So your home warranty will go into effect the date of closing. So from that point on, the coverage is 13 months and the homeowner does have the option to renew that. And the company will begin contacting them about 60 days prior to that warranty expiring to see if they're interested in renewing. And Kim, I know when we purchased our policy, uh, we were pleasantly surprised by the affordability of it. I know everything is specific to the the individual home that's being purchased and, and what's being covered by the warranty. But generally speaking, you know, what uh, what is it that people can, can look for? Do you find that people are, are pleasantly surprised by the cost? They are. And one of the great things about um, Home Warranty of America is if for any reason the home warranty does not get included in the transaction at closing and worked into a settlement statement, we do offer a 13-month payment plan for homeowners where they can still go through um, their real, real estate agent even after the fact, after closing, if they were kind of indecisive whether they thought they wanted the home warranty or not, we still can um, at any time place that order for them. Oh, that's great information. Lisa, any uh, any other thoughts you have for people that uh, might be, you know, wondering about home warranties? If you are one of those sellers that feel like you're in a soft market, this might be an extra way to increase your chances of getting your home sold or selected when a when a buyer's out there, you know, looking at multiple options. That's a good point. Yeah. So it's a very affordable way. And the other thing we've been using it lately for is when we're having inspection uh, concerns. And it's not that this is broken because that's not what the warranty's for. But like, hey, oh, I didn't realize that the AC unit is X amount years old and yet it's completely functioning and it's working and it's in great condition. It resolves those issues, those issues kind of the, oh, I didn't know that in three years I might have to financially, um, you know, replace something. So it gives, once again, peace of mind. A lot of our sellers are offering it when there are inspection issues, and it's a lot less expensive to offer a home warranty than it is to go ahead and start replacing AC units, for example. Um, Statistically, 
homes that are on the market do sell uh, 10% faster than their counterparts when you have a home warranty on them, and they do receive more clicks online, and they are selling for $2,300 more than other homes that are on the market. So if you are in the process of selling your home, contact Lisa about um, putting listing coverage on and getting your home sold quicker. Thinking about all of this in context, listening to the truths can be some of the best advice I could ever provide to you. Because, look, we're all experts in certain areas. And, uh, you know, for most of us, real estate isn't going to be one of them. And even if we're knowledgeable about real estate, what about the entire process end to end? And that's where the truths really can help you in ways that you might not have even realized, like with a home warranty and even some of these strategies that Lisa was just talking about in the seller's market, which is a little bit softer in general right now throughout the Palm Beaches, throughout South Florida generally. So uh, reach out to them seven days a week. They're ready to help you. Call 561-972-8326, 561-972-8326. And again, you can always go to truerealestate911.com. I'm Brian Mudd for Lisa True and our guest this week, Kim Hibbs from HWA Home Warranty. We'll see you next time.